Ladies and gentlemen, this is your favorite boy, Larry, here from the Shizzle Network, here back again. I am going to be vlogging, believe it or not. Yeah, that's right. I am literally going to be going to New York City today. It's going to be really interesting, I'm not going to lie, because I've never been to New York City before, so I'm going into this city with a fresh and open mind. I'm pretty much going to love it. Like, we're going to be doing photos and all that stuff there, so uh, I'm going to be, yeah, I know it's bright, but... Yeah, I'm going to be uh, enjoying myself. I'm going to be vlogging a lot while I'm there. So, it's going to be really it's going to be really cool. So, let's see it again. Got gotcha. you. Oh, you got the nigga spoiler. Oh my god, my glasses. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, I finally made it on to the bus. It was actually quite fast to get here. I was actually quite surprised. I thought it was going to be a slow process. So, we were supposed to be here like 20 minutes prior, but we still made it here in the nick of time, despite all the bullshit that we had to go through because we were struggling to try to find parking and all that. But we still made it, so yeah, I'm on the bus right now, and we're on our way to New York City. And meanwhile, I got my big boy right here because obviously I'm gonna have a lot of work to do, both going there, being there, and then coming back from there. Now, whether or not that makes sense to you or not, I don't know, but I'm just saying, I got work to do. I'll see you when I get to New York. Still, I think the bus is still like trying to find its uh, trying to find its station before we can finally depart off of it and then finally explore New York like we're going to. There's gonna be tons of video clips being recorded everywhere, and I'm talking like maybe not a hundred billion, but a lot. But hey, I'm gonna also be showing my portfolio too because I'm gonna be taking a lot of photos here too. So I'm gonna have a portfolio coming up. I'm not gonna put it in this video because that's gonna be a whole lot of work to do. But I will possibly leave a link down in the description where you can see all the photos I took. But I need to edit them first. So nine times out of ten, the videos are—I mean, the photos are most likely gonna be done before I even upload this video. So yeah, just thought I'd throw it out there. Okay. Okay, folks, made it to New York City. All right. We just got five guys right here. So. They really hooked us up with all the fries and everything. Now my main goal for the day is to just pretty, pretty much explore. We don't really have any other main other objective other than just exploring New York City. But what I do plan to do is I want to capture all the major landmarks in New York City. That being Statue of Liberty and all that. And the Empire State. That's what I plan to do. But for now, let's just get fat and just enjoy the atmosphere that is NYC. Let's be 
Ladies and gentlemen of New York City, the camera's all ready. It's all here. We're going to get a lot of great shots. I'm going to capture my main four architectures while we're here. It's very crucial. We got to walk towards 7th Avenue. 7th Avenue? Where's that at? Oh, this so direction. We've got to go to 42nd and Lexington. Okay, gotcha. So we're still taking our shots. And we got the Chrysler building, which looks tall by here, but it's not the tallest out of all the buildings. It just looks tall over here by comparison. But trust me, we still got we still got our multiple shots. So now we have to get to Empire State next, which is not too far from here. Cause like it was because like it was way back there. I think we have to like go up there and then like make a right. I think. Little stores like that, you know? they're everywhere. So oh, no. But that but that's a really good deal. He cut off like damn. I really could have gotten it, but like I said, I was just Indeed. thinking about how much money I needed to save. Once again, remember I said in Korea they they have some, those guys. I don't think they were Korean, but they were Asian. They they, they, they tend to hustle with you. That's why he knocked like damn near three hundred dollars off that thing. Uh-huh. So, yeah. I just need to let everyone know right now that as far as this video is going, I have an empire state of mind. Bruh. <laughs> Look at this. Look at this thing. If you want it. Yep. Uh, we should try it. I'm going to still go up there and see if I can get it from top down. I mean, not top down. What do I keep saying that? Bottom up, yeah, that's what I'm trying to say. I'm sorry, you, you already know my, you know, you know my word choices can be very poor at times. At times, square. <laughs> I fucking suck at doing puns, dude. I really suck. Cause it's like I've seen this in the movies, but the building looks just as equally beautiful as it does when you see it in person. You know, you know the only reason why I love it so much is because of the... You guys have seen King Kong 1933, right? I'm sure, I hope, so, I hope most of you have seen it. It's a very iconic film. King Kong, like this was back in 1933, the one that Willis O'Brien did, where he did the stop motion on King Kong. King Kong literally went out of his way to carry uh, Anne, the, the character Anne in his hands, and he climbed up the Empire State Building to the very top where he was shot down by uh, airplanes. And then King Kong fell to his death. It was a very iconic scene, and it all happened right on this, right on this beautiful architecture. It's beautiful. Okay, so we're on our way now. We're gonna be walking two bridges. We're gonna be doing Manhattan Bridge, and we're gonna be doing Brooklyn Bridge. That requires me to walk over and look. You can still see that motherfucker still over there. Yeah, pretty cool, right? <laughs> anyway, yeah, we're gonna have to like use our legs quite a lot we're gonna literally be working out trying to capture all my goals and everything like trying to get all the, the, the not just the skyline of New York City but also the architectures and the, but the problem is that we're gonna have to put in some work to get there like we literally have to use our fucking legs look at this shit I'm not even ready to go I'm not even ready to go I mean my fat ass is lazy I'm not gonna lie I'm such a fat ass I'm lazy, I can't run for shit. Although, I have beaten my own fat ass cousin in a uh, contest as far as bench pressing. So, I think I may do that. Yes, for those of you who don't know, I can bench press. But that's not that's not relevant here. Relevance, the relevancy lies in the fact that we are going to be going to the bridge and I'm going to fuck myself up. Cheers! Okay, so we made it on to the subway. We are going to be... We're literally on our way to get to the uh, Brooklyn, Brooklyn, no, actually the Manhattan Bridge, actually. We're going to be like in an area where you can kind of like walk in between, like whether it be Brooklyn or Manhattan, but that's our next destination now, because I already got shots of the Chrysler Building and the Empire State, so I'm happy about that, but I'm most likely going to get more shots of it anyway, because I'm going to be doing like the whole New York City skyline, so it's going to get, it's going to get interesting once we finally get there. Not sure how long it's going to be. But we wait. We're still venturing around and we capture some really cool buildings too. I could uh, show just a couple. Okay, so right there, that's uh, 
That's New York City Hall right there. Sorry if you can't see it because of the focus, but uh, yeah, that's what I got. Yep, that's that's New York City Hall right there. That's the Woolworth Building, one of the oldest skyscrapers in, that we have in this country, and one of the tallest in New York City. That's one of the shots I took of the Empire State Building. Yeah, I got the Empire State Building. Yes, I already told you guys that, and plus you saw it on video. So I got a decent amount. So I got a decent amount of uh, photos done, but we still have another goal. We still have to. Uh, we still have to get to those bridges and get a lot of shots. If you guys want to see the New York City Hall, it's right there, but there's trees blocking the way. You'll be surprised at how beautiful it actually looks. In fact, it's actually way bigger than Philadelphia City Hall, although not as prestigious as Philadelphia City Hall, because like Philadelphia City Hall is like more uh, internationally, not internationally, yeah, internationally well known, but this one is pretty fucking big. Like I'm actually, like I'm actually kind of surprised. Yeah, you said this is the Brooklyn Bridge, but uh, yeah, it is the Brooklyn Bridge. But look at this shit. Look at this shit. Look at all this fucking people, yo. Look at all this shit. That is beautiful. No, I'm not talking about. And no, I'm not talking about the people. I'm actually talking about the bridge. The bridge looks like a. It's a sight for sore eyes. I'm not gonna lie. But all this fucking people, dude. I'm gonna feel claustrophobic, dude. So I guess I could keep it slow on the walking, I hope. Oh my god, this is... And look at it, we literally just got started. We haven't even reached the first tower yet. Usually, after like a couple minutes, we usually reach the first tower. But we just barely made it. That is some bullshit. Oh my god. Yeah, we're fine. We, we're only halfway. We still even haven't reached the first fucking tower. Yeah, we're still not even. But I'm talking about we haven't even made it halfway to the first tower, and now we are. A third of the way there. You already know this is gonna be problematic. It's already problematic for me because I'm sweating my nuts off, dude. Are you sure? You sure that the reptile will live to see another day? The reptile can't survive this and he's no hero. <laughs> Goddamn bridge, he beat the violent drop. Yeah, you know. heard that reptile? He just said that if you can't survive this, then you're not a fucking hero. If you can beat the freaking violent drop, you can defeat a bridge. Exactly. Because this is nothing but child's play. Yeah, I'm assuming that there's Staten Island over there. Yep. Don't worry, well, we're a third of the way there. Take a look at what's down there, guys. Yep. The Queen herself. The Statue of Liberty. I'm gonna try to at least get a good photo of her. And there's the New York City skyline right there. There's Brooklyn. There's the Brooklyn Bridge right here. Actually, Brooklyn is already over here. But, uh, the Brooklyn Bridge is right here. Then you got the Manhattan Bridge right over here. And right over there, up in Manhattan, you can see the Chrysler Building and the Empire State right across from each other. Not a bad perspective. You know? But anyway, I'm gonna I'm gonna I'm gonna try the opportunity of a lifetime. I am gonna try to get the Queen herself on this friggin' camera. So I'm gonna try my absolute best. And let's see how this goes, guys. I finally crossed that Brooklyn Bridge. I haven't even recorded another video in a while, so there's New York City over there. There's a Manhattan Bridge. See, I wanted to make sure that I could uh, come around here and sit down, because right now I'm having a horrible, horrible time. Not necessarily a horrible time, but just only like in terms of like, you know, energy and all that stuff, because I'm like, I'm really running out, so I just really need to sit down for a little bit before I even think about going back out. So this is like a, uh, it's like some sort of park or some shit. So I can just like chill, relax, and let me get this fucking thing off on my back. You have no idea how tiring it is to walk out here because like it's so fucking hot out here. 
and the lack of water will literally just like dehydrate me really easily. But thankfully, I do have another bottle of water in case I attempt to die. Yeah, look at that fucking thing. You know, the thing is, is that the Manhattan Bridge isn't even listed as a landmark, but it's so fucking famous because it's one of the longest suspension bridges in the country. Still a beautiful sight, nonetheless. Okay guys, still we're still in New York City, still a nice daylight out. Now what we're going to do is that right now we're crossing the Manhattan Bridge right now. Uh, what we, oh my god, I'm sorry. Anyway, what we're going to do next is that we're going to go over to uh, somewhere in Manhattan, I don't know where. <laughs> I'm just mainly, you know, following my cousin, this, you know, this guy over here. Yeah, uh, we're going to be going over there and we're going to meet with my uncle. We're all going to have dinner together. So we're all going to pretty much get fat as a way of celebrating my first ever visit to not only the state of New York, but the city of New York City. Or shall I just say just the city of New York because that's... More or less the same. You know what? I don't understand why the city is named after its own state. I never understood that. But who the fuck cares? So <laughs> we're gonna. We got Kansas uh, City. Well, there's just Kansas City, Kansas, Kansas City, Missouri. There is no such thing as Pennsylvania City, Pennsylvania, though. That I know. <laughs> there is one. Oh, but did you know that there's a Philadelphia, Mississippi? Yep. Yeah, that's actually a fucking thing. Obviously, it's unrelated to our Philadelphia, but name nonetheless. Look, yeah, still in New York City. So, well, technically he's not supposed to be on this lane. I know. Oh wow, somebody actually made a A photographer had to do this. Yeah, I think so. I, I think I actually do want to kind of get the shot. There's the Statue of Liberty in the background right over there. Which I showed earlier. But yeah, look at it. Yeah, I gotta make sure I get my shot over here. I hope you got yours good. You got yours good? Yeah, I might take some more, but go ahead and take yours. Perfect. Oh, man. Really nice spot. I already took like a dozen, I already took like a dozen photos of it. skills are excellent. Yeah, that is beautiful, especially when you put it on video. It looks gorgeous from here. In beautiful 60 frames per second. Yes, I'm breaking the fourth wall, I don't care. We are just now reaching our end to our New York City trip. Because now, we're eating inside of pizza here. Yeah? And look at that. I have YouTube. Channel. Thank you. And, and I, was, I was concerned about being a professor. I was like, wait a minute, I can just teach people on YouTube. And eventually, we're going to, like, my best friend, he does going to do. I don't, I don't drink that shit, class, so like, forget about uh, that. About social media, about camera, but I'm still like, oh, what about this right here? So, yeah. I'm just trying to get that. Okay, so here we go. I'm actually oh. about to get some good photos done. Not just photos, but videos. So I'm gonna get a lot of stuff done while I wait for all this food. And yes, I got a lemonade. It looks so good though. Like, look at the lemon on the side. Nicely prepared and all that. These people deserve a raise big time. I mean, after all the walking around that we've done in New York, I could literally use break. A good meal. Look at this piece of bread. I got that right there. This is the cord. This is the cord I need for the phone. So we're gonna make this happen. I'm saying, my thing is, I've finished that yet, but and I followed the guy on Twitter. What the hell? Oh shit! 
Is that the... Is that Empire State? Oh, shit. Oh, shit. No, I think that's Chrysler, actually. Yeah, that's the Chrysler. I was wondering what it was at first. Yeah, there we go. We're just chilling out with family right now. Got my uncle and my cousin. Everything is going just fine, dude. Especially, look at how New York looks at night. It's so gorgeous. It is so beautiful. Everything is all calm and quiet. Still busy traveling and all that. Never have I ever felt this free in my life. Well, I do know I'm coming back here for sure. So today won't be the only time I'm coming here. That's for sure. going on I finally made it back to my humble home of Philadelphia uh, it was actually one hell of a ride like the whole trip was just absolutely amazing like I I felt so free like I never felt this free in my life like I, I managed to see a lot of things that I always loved as a kid like the Empire State Building like a very famous building that was used that was seen in movies like King Kong, I'm going to refer to the 1933 version since that's the one that made it famous. And, you know, countless other films where, you know, New York City was a prime film location. Unfortunately, Godzilla 1998 was one of them. Remember that scene where the Chrysler building got shot at? Yeah. Well, anyway, uh, that's not the point. I had a really fun time going there. Uh, yeah, my beard is itching right <laughs> My beard is really itching my face. That's probably because it's still growing out. So, yeah. But anyway, that's not the point. Uh, I had a really great time there. Uh, I'm definitely going back. I know, in fact, it's not going to be hard to get there and then back to Philly. In fact, it's actually quite easy to get there. Even though it's about a two-hour long ride. But it's actually really simple to just, you know, take bus tickets and then, you know, bus fare and then just go there all you gotta do is just take the bus up to new york and then boom there you go you've already made it so it's already really good uh so yeah thank you guys for watching this vlog i hope you guys did enjoy it it's actually like one in the morning right now what the fuck man there is a bug in here i think that's a fly oh well i ain't concerned about it so anyway yeah um i'm gonna get going and it's like one o'clock in the morning right now so i definitely need to go so if you guys did enjoy this video, be sure to subscribe for more videos from the Shoes of Network. And until then, peace out. This will be on the infinite. And as always, stay for yourself, guys. Now I can safely say, I heart NYC.